today we're gonna enter Mammoth Cave. Ready? Let's do this. Sand Cave Trail. Um, for 16 days on February the 25th, the world focused in on the attention of this remote corner of Kentucky as hundreds of people labored day and night to reach a cave explorer, uh, Floyd Collins, trapped in a narrow passage in Sand Cave, 60 feet below the surface. Drawn by newspapers, accounts of estimated crowd of 10,000 people gathered around sand cave on Sunday February the 8th so this is quite interesting this uh, trail is actually uh, made it's kind of like a boardwalk so this is our first hike here at Mammoth Cave technically it's not a hike it's not even like a quarter mile but uh yeah so actually the Smokies had a lot of these like planked trails that'd be kind of Cool, but then it wouldn't be fun. It wouldn't be the Smokies if we had like plank trails. But we'll take a little walk in the woods here. So it's been raining here like all night and all and most of the day, and it might have spoke too soon. It might be raining on us again. We originally planned we wanted to do a, a lot of different hikes here in Mammoth Cave, but because of the rain and also I actually left my hiking gear back in Tennessee. I uh, packed the car with everything we needed and I forgot my hiking gear. So we're not going to do anything too crazy today. But um, definitely we'll be back though, right? We talked about coming back, doing some more hiking, maybe some camping. And uh, yeah, and we're going to explore Mammoth Cave today. Oh wow, so that's that's the cave down there. Okay, so that placard back there talked about how they were trying to get Floyd um, out of the cave. And they, get, they kept having collapses and stuff. And they finally did reach him, but when they got to him, it was too late. And, but the bright side of the note, this actually brought so much attention to this area that that's when they started to petition the United States government to make Mammoth Caves a national park. So, uh, yeah, nice little walk. It's not a hike, it's a walk, but um, it's good to get out here in the woods again, especially in uh, southern Kentucky. Mammoth Cave Campground Visitor Center, straight ahead. So they have a campground here. They even got a post office. Visitor Center Mammoth Cave National Park. Oh wow, there's a there's a deer running through the There it goes. So this is the tour we're doing, domes and dripstones. Um yeah. Uh, are you prepared for the tour? Many tours require bending, stooping, climbing, many stairs, and walking long distances. Ask a ranger if you have any questions about your physical nature. Be advised. If you come in contact with a bat or any other wildlife, report it to park staff. No weapons, tobacco, vaping, selfie sticks, tripods, um, child black back carriers. No eating, drinking on tour. Do not feed the wildlife. Tour cost us seventeen dollars a person. Um, I, I don't know what I got myself into. I went up there and I said, "When's the next one taking?" And she goes, "This one here." I said, "Okay, well, let's do it." And seventeen dollars, so it's got to be a good one, right? Because I noticed like all the other ones were like six dollars. So maybe like it might be a couple hours long. I don't even know how long this tour is. Do you know? We gotta catch the bus, Gus. Gus, Gus. Gus, Gus. Down the bus, Gus. Down the bus, Gus. So it must be our. Uh, our ranger here. Ranger Randy, I'll be your lead guide on this tour. Pretty soon we'll be joined. There's just going to be a series of stairs and slopes. 
but there is some exertion on this tour. I gave up wearing a jacket on this tour a long time ago because I'm going to be sweating before long. Okay, we're going to burn some calories. So, okay, it is dimly lit. Uh, so always watch your head and your feet. If it's a little hard to do both at the same time, I can show you the scars on my hat. If you don't watch both, watch your language. Okay. Uh, because of the, the dimly lit situation, we do not allow uh, flash photography. Taking pictures is fine, but uh, please turn off your flashes. Now's the time to do it. If you don't know how, ask a 10 year old, they'll show you. <laughs> Always use uh, any handrails available. Stay on the trails. They're well marked. There's rocks at least along the sides. And on this tour, there's some nasty places you can get off into. And that's not good, okay? Trust me. So it looks like we took one of the hardest tours. Uh, it's like straight down, and they say it's pretty dangerous, right? So, but it's one of the most beautiful ones, right? And they say it's nothing like any of the other caves here in the park. So this is going to be interesting, right? <laughs> There's thousands of sinkholes in this part of Kentucky. One small one will open up and eat a Corvette music uh, and everything. Uh, but uh, this is one of the larger sinkholes, so we're going to be walking down a sinkhole. Uh, it will not look like a cave entrance, like say it's man-made uh, and everything. It's a concrete building with a steel door. But only that little first passageway you're going to walk between two doors. That's only this man-made. Everything else you see is natural. So you ready to go to the cave? Yeah, let's go do it. You want to walk slow? You right behind me. And this is how you get into the cave. Wow. Here. Yeah, yeah they're definitely. Yeah, so it's definitely tight. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely tight in here. Very, very, actually it's probably the most tightest uh, cave I've ever, I've ever been in. Oh wow. Yeah, so definitely the most tightest cavern I've ever been in. I can see the reason why they... And we're going straight down. Straight down. Wow, it just goes straight down. This is definitely not very wide. Wow, look at it just goes up forever and ever and ever. Um the one thing I will say though is um definitely have to be adventurous in this one. Oh, look at look at it. Look how high it goes straight up. Yeah, no, look at it. Don, what do you think? Kind of tight in here. This is the definitely the most tightest cavern I've ever been into. You definitely gotta be adventurous. And uh, I love it. I love it. I think it's great. Oh wow. Oh, okay. That is like straight down. Oh wow. Look at that. I can't even see the bottom. That's a bottomless pit. See that? Look at that stairway we just all come down from. Hi. So Dawn's leading the way now. Yeah. Oh yeah, there's writing on the walls that date back to the 40s. These are people from the 1940s. There's some more writing 
It dates back to the, the 40s. You can duck down here. And then we gotta go straight up. <laughs> oh, I see it. Yeah. All these steps are closer. Oh wow, look at Oh wow, look at the uh, this room here. Frozen Niagara. If I don't see you, I may not thank you for coming. <laughs> oh you're welcome. Oh wow, look at look at above us. Oh, there we go. Alright, so another tight squeeze. Call it the fat man squeeze here. Oh, wow. Crystal Lake. <laughs> wow, look at, look at this. Look at all the way up there. Oh wow, straight up. Oh wow, there's a bunch over here. Oh wow, wait till you see this over here. Absolutely. There's a column it actually met. That's the first column I've seen. All right. Oh wow. Another column over there. I see light. I see light. The spinny door. There goes your glasses. <laughs> what did you think about that? It was nice. Yeah. Uh, there wasn't a lot of slag tights, slag mites to the very end, and there was quite a few. Uh, did you hear him talk about the celebrities that have been down there? Yeah. That's pretty cool. And that uh, the CCC um, uh, Conservation Corps was the one to uh, put all the floor work in, and it's like walking on history. Really, really cool. The Lodge at Mammoth Cave, huh? So we're gonna go into the lodge here. Here's an old classic photo of the tour we just took. I actually remember that. Remember this in the in the tour? I like the slag tights hanging over the checkout. Here's some of the merch. That one's pretty cool. They have a lot of gift stores and they're a lot bigger than the ones in the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. Yeah. Look at these guys here. What do you think? Okay, so now we're back here at the main visitor center. Wow, that was really cool. That uh, we got to see at the end, it was uh, Frozen Niagara. That was really cool. 
Um, yeah, it doesn't have the beauty as the ones in like Tennessee got, the ones around the Smokies, but it was huge. And we went down, what, almost 300 feet, or 200 and some odd feet down. And my legs are rubber. That is a tough. You got to squinch down. It's like really skinny. Yeah. Yeah, I banged my head actually pretty bad. I can still feel it. Yeah, so wow. It was, uh, it was just totally crazy, wasn't it? If you like this vlog give it a thumbs up uh, please subscribe so you don't miss any more of these uh crazy road trip adventures we have and we're gonna have plenty of smoky mountain adventures just to come until next time thanks for watching thanks for watching